What is going on guys? My name is Cliff and today I am going to be covering two pretty cool topics But before we get into that, of course, as always, we gotta talk about the gameplay And so it is Rockies who is actually the leader of Hydra So I think it's pretty impressive that our leader is giving us some gameplays And what he does, he goes 104 kills, 8 deaths with the ASM1 on whatever the hell this map is called I don't know I haven't memorized the names from the maps yet, uh, so that kind of, you know, whatever. Um, eventually, if I play enough, I'll memorize them. So what we're going to be talking about today is two things. First is going to be how to become a pub stomper commentator. And then after that, we're going to talk about the holidays coming up and stuff like that. So without further ado, let's get into the first topic. And so I am one... Some other people that might be watching this video are one, and maybe you want to be one. It's a pub stomper commentator. Now, you might notice that we all do about the same thing. Now, it is sort of interesting how we all do the same thing. So, if you want to be one, you just got to do exactly what everybody else does. Rule number one, introduce yourself as I did at the beginning of this video saying my name is Cliff. After that, what you gotta do is talk about how you're gonna have a topic for this video. And then you gotta say, but before we get to the topic of the video, we gotta talk about the gameplay. And then you describe the gameplay by listing the gun, the map, which I didn't know the map, so I'm sorry about that, the player, and then you gotta say, be sure to check this player out in the description below, which you should do. You should go check out our leader, Rockies, in case you were wondering. So go check him out. And then you gotta say, and if you enjoy the commentary, be sure to check me out too. So if you guys enjoy the commentary, be sure to check out me too. My, my link will be in the description along with the Rockies. Oh my god, that's where we've discovered so much stuff about how to become a pub stopper commentator. So after that, you've got the gameplay. You've, got, you've described that. And it, it, you're, you're doing pretty well so far. And then what you gotta do is you gotta say, now that we've got the gameplay, and then you gotta describe the gameplay with amazing and sick words using like a very limited vocabulary of adjectives such as sick, amazing, incredible, absolutely amazing. Uh, that, that basically rounds up a uh, pub stomper commentator's vocabulary. Sick, amazing, incredible, awesome. Those four words get you everywhere when listing how good a gameplay is. It, it's amazing how far those words go. And then after that, you get into the topic of the video, which is what I did, which is what everybody does when you do a pub stomper commentary video. So it's pretty simple, but I thought, thought it was funny how literally everybody does it. Everybody that's a commentator for a pub stomping clan, they all do the same exact thing, and they go through that same like list and that's what they do so I thought I'd share it with you guys because I think it's funny how we all do the same thing and stuff like that so that was the first thing that we're gonna talk about today now to move on to the real topic of today's video it's the holidays they're coming up we get the presents we get the lights we get the Christmas music we don't get Hanukkah music cuz there's really no Hanukkah music sorry Jewish people and if you're watching this video from another country and you have another religion, which I didn't name, I'm sorry, but I don't know all the religions of the world I'm, or the holidays. I'm sorry. But I celebrate Christmas and Hanukkah because my step family is Jewish and I am Christian myself. So with the holidays coming up, I decided to talk about them a little bit. And it's really like... Everybody always says you always forget the true meaning of the holidays and how you, you're supposed to be thankful for what you have and it's not about the presidents, it's about spending time with family. It's like they say it so much that I feel like people might be starting to get the message. But you know what? I'm not. I like presents. I'm not going to lie. I like getting stuff for Christmas and whatnot. I think it's the best feeling in the world running down on Christmas morning and opening up your presents because it's like yay so much materialistic goods it feels so good to get stuff and this year actually i'm not going to be able to do that because i'm going to be going on a cruise for a little bit and that'll be fun it'll be like i don't know a week long i'm gonna get to go scuba diving go see all these amazing places go to water parks spend time with my family and that'll be just i think honestly amazing and incredible so 
with that, it's because winter break is coming up because, you know, pretty much all schools give their students off for winter break. So if you guys are going somewhere too or if you're doing something special for winter break, be sure to let me know and I, because I'd love to talk to you guys about what you're doing because here on the Hydra channel, we are all one big, happy, fluffy, jubilant family. Jubilant, is that the right word? I don't even know. Jubilant, jubilant, something like that. I think that I got something right about that, maybe, possibly. Who really knows? But along with that, it's like, I feel people, I mean, it's like the holidays are so much about materialistic goods, and I'm not gonna lie, I mean, like I just said before, I like getting presents, and it's, I mean, I don't think it's the worst thing in the world, because if you really think about it, that's what really matters, buying stuff, because that keeps the economy going, and that keeps our lives good and whatnot, so, uh, I think that's about that for that, so, I mean, let me know what you guys are doing for winter break and stuff, and if you're doing anything interesting, what you want for Christmas or Hanukkah or whatever holiday you celebrate, if you want something like the new Call of Duty, a new PC, or if you want the new Elgato or something like that, let me know because maybe Santa will just make your wish come true this year. I don't really know. And so remember to check out Rockies and check out me if you enjoyed the commentary or something. And um, if I did sound a little weird, it's because I'm still getting over like an eight-week sickness, and that really sucks. So now with the gameplay winding down, I have no idea how I just talked for seven minutes straight. I mean, I think that's pretty impressive if I do say so myself. So I'll let the rest of this gameplay wind down for a few seconds. 104 and 8, like I said before. Be sure to check them out, and then we'll roll the outro, and I'll see you all later. So... I hope you guys have a great day, a great week, a great month, and a great year, and until next time, I will see you all later.